Hello sir, good evening. I am Rupal from Industrial Outlook magazine and we are obviously here for RAI 2023. Let's just start with a brief introduction about yourself. Good evening. Uh, myself Rikesh and I am heading the entire cells here in Raison Solar. And I can just say about the Raison actually. So right now we have expanding our capacity up to 2.5 gigawatt. Okay, and we are going to add another milestone as a call like a Topcon series uh, and type of Topcon series up to 585 watt peak. Okay, and another side I can say that Kia yeah, in the future uh, definitely we are going to increase uh, uh, almost uh, 1 gigawatt or 1.5 gigawatt of production capacity as per the market demand. So, how Raisin Solar is adapting new technological advancements? About the new technology, as I earlier said, uh, we have already adopted the uh, Topcon series. Okay, right now we are installing our uh, new plant in the same premises. Okay, with the one gigawatt of capacity. Earlier we have 1.5 gigawatt, and now one gigawatt. That means almost 2.5 gigawatt, right? And the Topcon N series, you know that uh, is a new generation for a new era. And uh, Monopark is just going to be like little bit down because of this Topcon. And after that top con, the HGT uh, will be there. Okay, so might be it is possible like a top con series will be lap over on the monopark series. What is Raisin Solar's future outlook for solar industry? About future, see like we are very strong about the solar sector actually as per the policy and government support and all actually. Okay, and whatever the decided target by the central government, so we are just following the step and we are we are we are more focusing on the, our uh, quality side product uh, development and uh, whatever the trend future we just want to follow the same because the customer is just asking about the new product and everything about the new era so i can say that easily like we will definitely achieve mass milestone uh, maximum by 10 gigawatt of the production capacity in near future uh, in upcoming years so if we talk about quality, how Raisin Solar is working on quality and reliability of their products? About the quality and reliability, so we have already developed uh, in-house lab for each and every product. Okay, we have same IC chambers, CRT, PCT or uh, strength of the cell actually. Okay, thermography, so lot of lot of equipment we have. So we are just going to make making our lab as an NBL approved uh, uh, within a short time actually and uh, we have another PID uh, line as well okay so we are very conscious about our product quality because the market is uh, focusing on quality as, as as well as we are focusing on export okay so export market is totally depend on quality oriented okay so we are very confident about our product as as we are following the some step as, as about the quality that's so fair enough. So how's uh, Raisin Solar's R&D team is working? How they are helping you to grow? We have some of the guys who's done PhD and a good experience in solar more than 20 years in our uh, R&D side. Okay. They have uh, already developed, uh, as I said earlier, ki we have good uh, lab uh, instruments, we have good lab installments, everything there with the help of our R&D team and we are going to do NABL approved as soon as possible. So far, like we have done another PID line for the future requirements as well. Okay, because uh, there is a lot of inspection like a DCR market is also grown due to some uh, tender issue or some central government policy. Right. So we are we are very conscious about this. So our R&D team definitely doing a good uh, for our product development. And they have, we are very strong in the R&D side and quality side right now. So do you see new opportunities and challenges for solar sector? Challenges is only the price actually because you know that like the seriously this is a very downgrade market right now. Okay, so we are just worried about okay, how so far we are going to be and how they are going to be stopped right now. Okay, but uh, in the terms of challenges, uh, okay fine. We are just depending on some of the few news from the central government as ALM is going to be extended or not in near uh, for, for, for the next year. Okay, so this could be only challenges as a being a manufacturer of India, uh, like uh, Indian side. Wrapping up this conversation, um, w would you like to send any message to your customers? 
so my just a re- uh, request to all the people okay let's convert to black energy into the green energy go for solar go for rays on thank you